subscribe to Gizmo Times and get notified about our latest videos by hitting the bell icon. Techno Mobile has launched a new smartphone called the Techno Camon i Twin, uh, which is a bit similar to the Techno Camon i Click, which was the previous smartphone, but uh, this is priced lesser. The MOP of this phone is about 11,499, and there are a few specifications where these both the phones uh, are a bit similar. But let's talk about the i Twin first. This comes with a 6 inch HD plus display that's 720 into 1440 pixels and now most of the Techno and even the Infinix phones are coming with that 18 inch to 9 aspect ratio display uh, that's uh, the taller display having uh, uh, minimal bezels and only a little bezel on the top and a chin towards the bottom and this phone comes with the Qualcomm Snapdragon 425 chipset and along with that this 3GB of RAM 32GB storage and for the display itself again this comes with that 2.5D curved glass on the top towards the back it's a polycarbonate back and uh, not a metal one uh, though you can't remove the back and uh, you see that uh, the phone does look a, a bit similar to how the Techno Camon iClick was. So these are two phones that are uh, quite similar to each other except for that camera area where you see the new introduction of the dual lens camera. And this is the first phone from Techno to have that dual lens camera combination on this uh, device and it comes with the 13 megapixel plus 2 megapixel combination with a quad LED flash on the back which was the same on the Techno Camon iClick as well. The company says that there is uh, the AI support on the smartphone for the camera where it would do the auto scene detection and uh, then adjust the colors and contrast based on that. And there's 4x uh, digital zoom uh, offered here and the portrait mode which is uh, taking advantage of the dual lens camera combination here. And while the rear camera of the smartphone, the 13 megapixel one uh, comes with the f2.0 aperture, the same aperture size is given on the front as well, which also has a uh, 13 megapixel camera with the same aperture size. And there's also the LED flashlight support uh, for the selfies in low light conditions and for the security it's good to see that the company has opted for both the fingerprint sensor on the back and the face unlock feature as well for the battery there's a 4000 mAh battery again which is higher than what the techno came on iClick had uh, so here uh, there's quite a good support for the battery life and uh, the specifications are not that bad but still snapdragon 425 is a chipset that you might find in the budget range and not something that is about 10,000 rupees and for the phone there are two options so the one that we got for review is this uh, midnight black option uh, which is coming with the matte finish there's no glossiness on the back and there's another one that's champagne gold uh, which also comes for the same price and uh, the same specifications having 3 plus 32 gb of combination and the techno came on i twin runs uh, the high os uh, which is the customized os uh, or the customer interface uh, based on android 8.0 oreo and there are a few pre-installed applications uh, that are the social apps facebook whatsapp messenger and instagram and there are a few tools as well and this fm radio pre-installed and a few other uh, options given from techno itself in the high os there's also the freezer app that would freeze the apps that are not being used and they, they are kept in the background there's no ram being used at that time and that helps uh, which is similar to again uh, what is seen on the infinix smartphones as well under the camera application what you see are these modes uh, the different modes uh, for uh, the video recording the photo and there's also the beauty mode for both front and rear cameras there's the panorama and the best video recording that you get here is 1080p and uh, there's that portrait mode to take the portrait shots with the background blur using the secondary camera that's a 2mp camera here so this was all about the Techno Camon i-Twin. For a quick comparison with the Techno Camon i-Click, uh, the smartphone that was priced at Rs. 13,999, uh, the i-Twin is priced lesser, that's 11,499, and there's differences starting from the chipset itself. Because the i-Twin comes with the Snapdragon 425 from Qualcomm, while the i-Click came with the Helio P23 chipset from MediaTek. There's quite a lot of difference with the performance as well, with the specs and also with the clock speeds. But then for the final performance, there's not a lot of difference that we see here. But then the iClick had 4GB of RAM, 64GB storage, while the iTwin comes with the 3GB plus 32GB combination. Even for the cameras, there were differences because the iTwin now comes based on that name itself. You'll understand that a twin means here two cameras. So the dual lens camera combination is given on the iTwin. That's 13 plus 2 megapixel cameras and the primary one comes with the f2.0 aperture while on the iClick there's a single camera on the back that's a 16 megapixel one but it might take more light in because of the f1.8 aperture here again with the battery life as well there's some difference because there's a 4000 mAh battery that powers the uh, Techno Gammon iTwin while there was a 3750 mAh battery that powered the Techno Gammon iClick and finally, the last difference was with the front-facing cameras. The iTwin comes with a 13 megapixel front-facing camera for the selfies, while there was a 20 megapixel camera that was given on the iClick. So the cameras actually might seem better on the iClick itself because of the better aperture size given on the back, but then you won't be able to take the actual portrait shots that are possible on the iTwin. Though we'll have to actually test it out and see whether the secondary camera is making a lot of difference or not. So this was a quick comparison with the iClick and the hands-on with the Technogamon i-Twin. So 
This was Chetan and I hope you like this video. If you have any other questions, do let me know and subscribe to Kismodan for more. Thank you for watching and see you in our next video.